So it's been a while since I did any Hot Wheels electronics videos. My video on putting in headlights was a fun project and I wanted to do another electronics based video which led to the car you see here. This is Nerve Hammer and it has been heavily modified. This is from the X-Racer series Patel has. All the X-Racers are made from clear plastic allowing you to see into them. So let me show you why this is important to this project. So as you can see, I've built in LEDs and the circuitry to allow the LEDs to dance to the music. I'm currently working on a video on showing how this is done, but wanted to get feedback and ideas before I produce the complete video. In my headlights video, I did my best to explain how the wiring was done, and that was simple wiring. This wiring is quite a bit more complex, so I'm curious what ideas you guys might have for showing how the wiring is done. What I was planning to do is build the circuit outside of the car, showing how all the components go together. But then I thought maybe I should build the circuit inside the car and show that. But that might be really confusing for people because you have to build the circuit around the space in the car. Right now I have the lights working on three button cells, three resistors, two transistors, a capacitor, and a small microphone. The battery holder is 3D printed and takes three energizer 392s or LR41s. As you can see, the wiring is a bit of a mess. Cramming and soldering all this in this little space was not easy. For my how-to video, I got the X-Razor AeroPod, a much larger model to help filming. And that's another question I'd like to ask. Does anyone know of a better car to put this in? I have a couple of ideas I may try and do for the video, but you guys always have better ideas. So if you can think of a perfect car, let me know below. So the main question I would like has to do with your opinion. I was thinking of submitting this design and idea to Mattel. They actually have a site dedicated for people to submit their ideas. I think this would be a rather cool gimmick that would be fun to collect. I also think it would look cool in the toy aisles. You clap your hands and 50 cars light up. It seems like that would get people's attention. Oh yeah, and if you're wondering what it looks like on a Hot Wheels track, The booster is so loud that the lights stay on, but it really looks cool all the same. The last thing I'll bring up is that I'm thinking about making a couple of these and placing them on an eBay auction with a $1 starting bid. I always get people wanting to just buy this stuff instead of making it themselves. But this is one that's a bit tricky if you have never soldered anything before. So please let me know below what your thoughts and ideas are. I was thinking of spraying the inside of the body with clear glow-in-the-dark paint and see what kind of glowing effect I could get. I'll let you know how that turns out in the how-to vid. Anyway, thanks for watching.